the AI industry is absolutely exploding. Google's Gemini and OpenAI's Sora AI has taken us all for a roller coaster so far this year. Archie here, your guide to the world of AI. Do you remember that viral video a while back where Google supposedly showed Gemini detecting a ball under a cup? Turns out it was staged. The fallout from this fake promotional video had everyone shaking their heads, asking Google, what were you thinking? How do you come back from this? How can you possibly regain our trust and is Gemini a fraud? But fast forward a few months and Google held true to their promise with Gemini. In fact, Google's back in the game with a real heavyweight, Gemini 1.5 Pro. What Gemini is now able to do with video content is insane. Gemini can watch a nature documentary and identify every single animal feature. You could provide Gemini with a video of a sports game and it can tell you every player's stats in a matter of seconds. The capabilities of Gemini are now pretty mind-blowing. But when you look across the aisle, you have the heavyweight from OpenAI, Sora AI. Arguably the most advanced, impactful AI tool to have hit the market so far this year, and maybe ever. Sora gives the everyday person the ability to produce insane video footage, all with a single text prompt. With a single text prompt describing a complex scene, it will use its knowledge to create a realistic video based on your description. Imagine describing a bustling Tokyo street at night, and Sora could generate a video capturing the neon lights and movement. If your text description involves multiple scenes or a continuing character, Sora can keep those elements consistent throughout the video. For instance, imagine describing a walk through an art gallery. Sora can generate a video with a consistent character and visual style throughout the various artworks. But as we all know in this world, there are winners and there are losers. The real question everyone is wanting to know, which product will be the one to gain widespread market adoption and has a chance at actually changing the world? Archie here. That's exactly what we're about to break down today. Let's go. To answer the question, we need to understand these products further. First, OpenAI surprised everyone with Sora, the text-to-video machine. Feed it a description, and bam, it creates a video based on your words. Need a robot training video? A mind-blowing animation? Sora's got you covered. Google wasn't going to miss out on the party though. They continued with Gemini 1.5 Pro, an AI that analyzes and edits existing videos. While Gemini cannot generate videos from scratch, its real strength lies in its editing power. It can dissect a video, understand the details, and then make precise edits. So what's the difference? Sora lets you create entirely new videos from your imagination. Gemini, on the other hand, is your super smart video editor. Give it a regular video, and it can analyze it, suggest edits, or even make them itself. Basically, Sora is the Dreamweaver, conjuring new visuals from scratch. Gemini is the Analyst Editor, dissecting and perfecting existing ones. Both are powerful tools, and which one you choose depends on your needs. Need a brand new video? Talk to Sora. Want to edit an existing one to perfection? Gemini's your guy. Google had wasted no time showing off Gemini 1.5 Pro's capabilities. They threw Sora a curveball and analyzed a video it created. On their platform, Google shared a breakdown done by Gemini. It dissected a video Sora made of a snowy street in Japan, but with cherry blossoms blooming. Something wasn't quite right, was it? Gemini 1.5 Pro caught this oddity, sparking a conversation about the truthfulness of AI-made videos. Can we always trust what we see if a computer generated it? That's a question these powerful AI tools are making us ask. The ability to analyze videos and detect anomalies is exactly what makes Gemini such a weapon against deepfakes and other AI-generated fakery. Deepfakes and AI-generated videos in general often rely on tricking our eyes. They stitch together real footage or create convincing but slightly off simulations. Gemini 1.5 Pro acts as a video detective, spotting these inconsistencies. It can dissect a video frame by frame, scrutinizing movements for unnaturalness, lighting for glitches, or even subtle differences in how someone blinks or talks. These are tiny details we might miss, but Gemini can flag them for further investigation. Deepfakes also struggle with consistency. Picture a video where someone's talking, but their mouth movements don't quite match the words. Or maybe a scene jumps abruptly, with lighting or background details changing weirdly. Gemini 1.5 Pro can track these inconsistencies across the video, comparing how things move and sound in different parts. If something doesn't flow naturally, it raises a flag. But Gemini's power goes beyond just spotting visual oddities. It can also understand the context of a video. Let's say a news report shows a politician making a controversial statement, but their facial expressions don't seem to match the anger in their voice. 
Or maybe someone's giving a speech in front of a background that suddenly changes location. These are the kinds of things we might gloss over, but Gemini can pick them up because it understands the bigger picture. The best part? Gemini can analyze a ton of content quickly. Imagine giving it hours of video footage and letting it loose. It can sift through everything, searching for patterns and inconsistencies that might indicate a deepfake. Even if a deepfake is really well made, there's a good chance Gemini will spot something suspicious thanks to its near-perfect recall. It remembers everything it sees, making it tough to fool with clever editing tricks. In essence, as AI-generated content becomes more realistic, tools like Gemini 1.5 Pro will become essential for staying safe online. By combining its video analysis, contextual understanding, and ability to handle massive amounts of data, Gemini can help us fight misinformation and manipulation. Whether it's a deepfake video or a cleverly altered image, Gemini holds promise for a future where we can trust what we see online just a little bit more. The real game changer for Gemini 1.5 Pro is its ability to understand vast amounts of information at once. Compared to previous AI models, Gemini can hold on to a million times more information in its quote-unquote mind. That's like remembering an entire conversation compared to just a few words. For instance, most AI tools might struggle to summarize a lengthy book or transcript, right? Well, Gemini 1.5 Pro throws that struggle out the airlock. Take the Apollo 11 mission to the moon, for instance. Gemini 1.5 Pro analyzed all 402 pages of transcripts, a conversation spanning hours, filled with technical jargon and moments of high tension. For Gemini 1.5 Pro, that's a piece of cake, all thanks to its long context understanding. The same goes for video. Gemini can dissect an entire hour of footage, picking up on subtleties and inconsistencies that might slip by a human viewer. This ability to handle massive amounts of data is even more powerful because Gemini isn't just a text whiz. It's a multimodal master, meaning it can understand different types of information at the same time. So while analyzing a video, it can not only read captions or descriptions, but also look at the visuals and pick up on things like unnatural movements or lighting glitches. Just like in this photo, where a user uploaded a video of a crowded street scene and Gemini 1.5 was able to answer detailed questions about what happened in it, down to individual car brands and types. This combination of long context understanding and multimodal capabilities makes Gemini a powerful tool for analyzing complex information, especially in the realm of video analysis, where piecing together visual and textual clues is key. Alright, alright, enough about Gemini, and let's move on to the other contender here, Sora AI. Let me show you the technical part of Sora AI first. At its core, Sora is powered by a diffusion model. It starts with noisy images and gradually refines them, step by step, until a clear video emerges. It's like watching a blurry picture slowly sharpen into focus. Like its tech-savvy cousins, Sora uses a transformer architecture. Transformers are great at handling large amounts of data and identifying relationships within it, which helps Sora process complex text descriptions and turn them into visual sequences. Sora doesn't dive straight into pixels. Instead, it operates in a latent space, a compressed representation of visual information. This makes processing and manipulating video data more efficient. Just as GPT models break down text into tokens, Sora divides videos and images into smaller units called patches. This approach allows Sora to handle videos of varying resolutions, durations, and aspect ratios during training, giving it a broad scope. And what many people actually don't realize, Sora incorporates a clever technique from Dolly 3, another AI model for image generation. It involves creating detailed captions for the video training data, providing richer information for Sora to learn from, and resulting in more comprehensive video generation. So with all of that understanding, and I do hope you're still paying attention, hey, hey, wake up, wake up! Sora is your cutting-edge AI model that can turn your text descriptions into stunning videos. Whether they're grounded in reality or straight out of your wildest dreams, from scratch. And that last part, ladies and gentlemen, is what makes Sora AI so special. We haven't seen a product be able to do that, at this level of sophistication, ever. And it's why everyone is in awe at its release. Enough of me telling you about it. Take a look firsthand with this simple text prompt, what Sora AI is able to produce in a matter of seconds. Every time I see Sora AI in action, I'm blown away by its capabilities. So how do we see Sora AI in the real world? Traditionally, making videos required a bunch of technical know-how, fancy equipment, and editing skills. Well, not anymore. With Sora, all you need is a text description, and you can whip up a video like a pro. 
Imagine knocking together a snazzy explainer video for a school project, or a slick marketing clip for a small business, all without needing any fancy tools or training. Sora isn't just about making video creation easier, it's about expanding creative horizons. Whether you're a storyteller, animator, or game developer, Sora opens up a whole world of possibilities. Picture this, storyboarding scenes with AI-generated videos or crafting dynamic in-game environments straight from your text descriptions. And let's not forget about efficiency. Sora is a time saver, plain and simple. Need some stock footage, concept art, or a basic explainer video? Forget about filming and editing. Sora can churn out a polished video in no time based on your description alone. Talk about streamlining the creative process. Whew. Sora blurs the line between reality and fiction with its knack for creating realistic videos. It's the exact reason why Tyler Perry canceled the expansion plans for his multi-million dollar film production studio. He sees what Sora AI can do. If you don't think that's industry disruption at its finest, then I don't know what is. So who wears the crown? Sora or Gemini 1.5 Pro? Like we have already explained, Gemini 1.5 Pro by Google shines when it comes to information. It's a data wizard, effortlessly processing mass amounts of text, audio, and even video, with incredible output. On the other hand, OpenAI's Sora focuses on creating visual stories. It takes your words and spins them into captivating videos, from scratch, in a matter of seconds. Drumroll please! So, which is better? Well, is there actually a world where both of these products could coexist? Sure. I know that's not the answer you want to hear. You want us to tell you this product wins, and the other will lose and fall away to never be seen again. But, ladies and gentlemen, I just don't see that happening. When you open up the hood of these two competing products, and we've been thinking about this for a while now, these are two vastly different products. The need to use either of these products depends entirely on your exact needs. If you're drowning in data and need a helping hand to make sense of it all, Gemini might be your perfect partner. But if you're looking to bring your ideas to life with stunning visuals, Sora could be your best bet. We see a world where both of these products will have a role. Ultimately, both models showcase the rapid advancements in video AI. And as these models continue to develop, who knows what amazing capabilities they might unlock in the future? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section and let's keep the conversation going. Want to tell your friends tomorrow? The battle between Sora AI and Gemini will continue, no doubt. And while we live in a capitalist society where winners and losers will emerge, and products will begin to gain widespread adoption, when it comes to Sora AI and Gemini, Archie sees a world where these two will coexist. Come find me in five years, and we'll see if my prediction rings true. But for now, Watch this other insane AI update right here.